What's going on guys? Shumble Gaming here, another Black Myth Wukong boss guide, this time non-able. This guy's a beast, really hard fight. I'm going to use some potions before the fight to increase the damage. I charged up the focus points on the enemies around in the area, so that way you can start with a fully charged focus point attack right off the bat. I'm going to use the Wither and White spell to stun him for a second too, and then I'm going to immobilize. I'm trying to push this guy into second phase basically as quick as possible. If you can get through the first phase with basically all your health potions, obviously it's going to set you up for the best. So, as you can see here, we basically got him all the way down without even really getting hit into the uh, second phase by using all those spells. And we, but we still have our red strikes and we still have a good amount of mana. Second phase starts, he's going to run at you and try to grab you. Run to the left, dodge to the left, you should be able to dodge it. And then use another charge attack if you have it. And at this point, I'm going to look for a good opportunity to use that red light spell. If you land all five strikes of the red light spells on this guy, you will apply the burn status to him, which will do damage over time, which obviously will help with the uh, fight here. I'm not going to get it. I'm going to only get four of the five strikes. He's going to cancel that last one. But we still got four good strikes on here that did a lot of damage. At this point, it's up to you, if you what you really want to do. If you want to use a pluck of many, I do eventually use it here. Or if you want to save the mana for just the five strikes and immobilize. A pluck of many is not great in this fight, but it does help a little bit because sometimes he does attack those monkeys instead. Use that immobilize when it's up to stop his attacks. And then land some strong attacks with that as well. If you have any more potions, I, uh, it might be a good time to uh, cast them. I do cast a couple more potions here in the second phase just to make sure that I get this guy down. I was wiped on him for quite some time. This is an optional boss, so if you are really struggling on it, I recommend just keep playing the main story. You can always come back to this guy after you've grinded a few more levels and played through a little bit more. Hope this video did prove helpful to appreciate a like. This guy is a beast, so good luck with him and enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks.